This video is going to walk you through how to create a new user account with Pionex. Pionex is a crypto exchange where you can access very easy to manage crypto trading bots as well as buy and sell crypto and move it to and from your bank account. If you're in the United States, you go to Pionex.us and if you are in the rest of the world, just regular Pionex.com. Then we're going to want to click register. You will want to register with your preferred email address. I recommend changing your password periodically on any kind of account where you're going to be doing financial stuff. Then referral code. If you want to use my referral code down below, thank you very much. Click on I agree with Pionex terms. Once you are signed in, you'll be hit with a really easy page that gives you the option to create a bot, receive crypto. What you need to do first order of business before you create any bots, take care of setting up your security. First things first, you're going to want to go over to your account settings and what you're going to want to do, you have Google Authenticator. You're going to want to set up Google Authenticator, SMS authentication, I recommend doing all of these things and the reason is that's triple layers of security so that nobody can get into your account and then send your crypto to some other wallet. This is paramount because it would be very hard for a scammer to have all three of those things. On the dark web sometimes they can have a combo of both of those things which is why I like to update my passwords regularly but all three of those is going to be very hard for any scammer to pull off. You know what? I think I'm going to ignore that step and just set up a simple password. Oh no! All my crypto's been stolen! <laughs> <laughs> Don't let that happen to you. Seriously. Last up, but certainly not least, your KYC. I'm talking about the part where you submit your government ID and you verify your identity somehow. Usually you upload a little video yourself, maybe turn side to side, all that stuff. And then within a couple days, your account is cleared for full action on the exchange. Once you've set that up and you're ready to go, you're ready to fund your trading account. Funding your trading account is done by selecting the wallet menu you have basically two options. Deposit will allow you to work with a debit card and I believe a wire transfer. And then we have send and receive crypto. If you already have cryptocurrency in an existing wallet, this is how you would send it over. We'll cover both of those today. First, let's go to deposit USD. It gives you 0% fees up front, which is pretty cool. Enter the amount you want to deposit click submit. So I'm just going to say 200. You are linking your bank account under the same name as the owner of this Pionex.us account. Confirm. And this will take us through a setup where we're going to link a bank account. Right here, you're going to enter in your email, your first and last name, and you're going to search for your bank. And I assume this is going to work like Plaid, or maybe it's even running on Plaid, I'm not certain. You will sign in with your bank account, connect your bank account, and of course, if you don't want to connect your bank account, over here on the side, we also have the option for debit card funding and wire transfer. And with wire transfer, you'll scroll down and they give you all the details you need to wire your funds. I imagine with bank account or debit card, it's going to be funded pretty much instantly. If you already have cryptocurrency and wish to fund with your crypto, select receive crypto. This takes you to your crypto wallets and then you will be able to find your wallet address and you'll be able to send crypto to that address from whatever external wallet you happen to hold. Always make sure you are sending on the correct network. And what I mean by that is right here where you have these options like Ethereum, ERC20, Tron, TRC20, BNB, Smart Chain, Arbitrum. You just need to make sure that whatever you've selected in the app where you're sending is also available right here. So just make sure you're always sending to the right network. 
The difference in each network might be a matter of cost or the amount of time it takes to send the crypto. My preferred, just to let you guys know, the Arbitrum One network for US dollar tether. The reason I choose this, it's almost instant every time I send it. If you have a different coin that you wish to send, you just select that coin from this list, search out the coin, copy the wallet address and the same goes. Paste that wallet address into your other wallet, send there and you have funded your account and you are ready to start up your first crypto bot.